What happened to you? Is it true that your wife killed you? Do you know the name of the person that killed you? If so, can you tell me who it was? I'm getting the chills right now. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Costas here from Gold Rush Paranormal. Thank you so much for tuning in. And I don't know about you guys, but over here I have been on lockdown at my home for quite a while now because of everything that's going on in the world. And during my off time, I have found a new TV show or TV series, I guess you can say, called Tiger King. And for those of you that are not familiar with the show, I'll give you a little overview. There is a character by the name of Carol Baskin who was married to a Don Lewis. Don Lewis was a multi-millionaire and he was breeding wild animals like tigers and lions. And on one specific day, he decided that he wanted a divorce from his wife Carol and told her about it. And then the very next day he vanished. Speculation is that Carol had him killed or killed him herself and that she basically fed him to the tigers because they were not able to recover a body. So why am I doing this session? Well, the name Don Lewis rang a bell for me because a little while back I did a session and I got a name which I thought at the time was John Lewis, but then when I played it back, it sounded like Don Lewis. So I'm gonna show you guys that here in just a second, but if you are interested in anything paranormal, ITC, or spirit communication related, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you can be notified when I do release a video. So after doing this session, I believe I was able to make contact with Don Lewis and I got some pretty incredible responses. So do you really want to find out if Carol Baskin murdered her husband, Don Lewis? Let's go ahead and find out. I'm looking for my spirit guides. Are they here? Here, are you in this room? Here in this room? Okay, thank you. Who's here? What are your names? Did you say Don? Nope. No. Okay. Is Don Lewis here? I'm looking for Don Lewis. It's not Lewis. He died, supposedly died many years ago. And, and he was a breeder of tigers and other wild animals. So he was married to Carol Lewis at the time. She is now remarried. She is remarried right now and her name is Carol Baskin. Okay, so I'm gonna focus on Don Lewis. I think I heard your name, I'm gonna assume you're here. So let's get started. At this moment, I believe that I was talking to my spirit guides who assist me with bringing other spirits forward for communication. There were a couple references that caught my attention. The first one was Dog Snack and then Meat Through the Grinder. There are many that believe that Don Lewis's wife, Carol Lewis, who has now been remarried and goes by the name Carol Baskin, murdered her husband just a day after he told her he wanted a divorce and that she grinded up his remains and fed him to the tigers. Is it possible that she fed him to the dog? Dogs also as a quote dog snack. Is Don Lewis dead or alive? Okay, so Don Lewis, did you come through to me? Yeah. You did? Were you trying to get my attention so I can get this message across? Um, shit. 
I believe I finally made contact with Don Lewis again. I say again because several sessions ago, I got a message from someone that said their name and at the time, I thought it said John Lewis, but believe that it may have been Don Lewis as I have had many instances where I will hear a name that doesn't make sense to me and find out either days or weeks later that the spirits were trying to give me a message about that person. I will discuss this in more detail in a future video, but here's a clip from that session. Who is with me right now? Can you tell me what happened to you? I should know that? I should know what? Don Lewis, can you tell me what happened to you? I'm not exactly sure if Zoe is someone he ever knew in life, or perhaps if she's a helper or guide of his on the other side. Were you killed? Don Lewis? He was what? Don Lewis. This spirit said that, quote, he filed the letters. Was she referring to divorce documents or something else? Who killed you, Don? What happened to you? Is it true that your wife killed you? Where is your body? Can you tell us where your body is? Can you tell us where your body is? He mentions that Timmy killed him, and when asked if his wife killed him, he said, quote, it looks like that. And finally, he said, quote, that boy I knew one year. Is it possible that his wife Carol was complicit in his death and hired someone by the name of Timmy who he knew for a short while? There is speculation that maybe you were fed to the tigers. Is that true? Did you say something about Carol? No. No? Okay. So, do you know the name of the person that killed you? If so, can you tell me who it was? Your wife. Did you just say your wife? Getting the chills right now. Don, thank you. I appreciate you. Do you know why did she kill you? You were dead for five years before. When asked if he was fed to the tigers, he said, quote, apparently so. And then when asked who killed him, a spirit said, quote, the wife. And he confirmed it by saying, quote, yep. Then I asked why she killed him and he said, quote, hide the gold slips. I'm not exactly sure what that means, but it's worth noting that Don was a multimillionaire and Carol could have lost it all as Don wanted a divorce. Was she wanting him dead for the money? Finally, a spirit chimes in and clearly said, quote, Carol's guilty. So you don't know where your body is, is that correct? You would not assume? Okay. So Don, Don Lewis, can you tell me, did you write in the will? Did you write in the will that your wife can have everything if, if there was a disability or a disappearance of you. 
Did you write that will? Is that something that you wanted in the will? For those that are not familiar with the case, apparently there was a document that Don supposedly signed giving his wife, Carol Lewis, Baskin, power of attorney. But what was highly unusual was that in the document it said if he was ever, quote, disabled or for a, quote, disappearance. When I asked if he wrote that document, a female spirit abruptly said, quote, no, and shortly thereafter mentions the word, quote, guilty once again, as if to make a point that his wife, Carol, was to blame. Finally, he calls me by name and says, quote, new message, Costa, as if to make sure he got my attention before saying the next word, which was, quote, forged. This was an incredible message, as it is believed that he would have never given her that authority. Can you tell me, Don, you said to someone that if you were able to pull it off, it would be the biggest, and I can't... Could you say that again? You'd be glad to? Please do so. I started asking Don a question and he interrupted me by saying, quote, what about disappearance? As if to say that was more important than the question I was asking him about. So, Don, I want to ask you, did you tell someone that if you were able to pull it off, it would be the biggest, and I can't remember the exact word you said, like biggest scheme ever or something like that. Yeah. You, you did? What were you referring to? Can you tell me again what you were referring to? I asked Don about a claim from his handyman that said that Don mentioned, quote, if I pull this off, it will be the slickest thing I ever did. And Don affirmatively said, quote, yeah, and? Then he said, quote, but to avoid, and quote, thought about her and a shortcut. It's well known that Don was trying to escape Carol and go to Costa Rica. Were you planning on leaving the country? Where were you planning on going German. to? Did you say German? I don't know if I heard that right. Where were you planning on moving to? When asking Don where he was planning on moving to, to my surprise, he said, quote, German. And then he said, quote, we got new flight, which is interesting because he flew a lot. Also, when asking for confirmation where he was planning on moving to, he said, quote, two minutes south. Don Lewis lived in Tampa, Florida, and Costa Rica is directly south. Was Don speaking to me metaphorically when he said, quote, two minutes south? And was he planning on moving there with someone of German descent, possibly Zoe? There was a country that you really love to go to. Hey, sure. Were you planning on moving to Costa Rica? In the matter, too. Sounds like Don was confirming that he wanted to, quote, end the marriage, too. I just heard you say my name, I believe. Thank you so much. You're coming. I feel like we have a really strong connection right now. I can I can almost yep. feel your energy. Do you th have anything you'd like to say to your wife at the time?
Carol Lewis, who is now Carol Baskin. Uh, I don't Do you have any messages for your for your kids? Everyone. This was interesting. I asked if he had anything he wanted to say to his wife Carol, and he said, quote, I don't, and then follows up with, quote, and we answered, as if to say he was able to get his message across. But who is we? Could it be Zoe, or just another spirit that was communicating with him? Finally, I asked if he had any messages for his children, and he responds by saying, Carolyn. I don't believe he has any children with the name Carolyn, which leads me to wonder if he got confused with my question and was referring to his wife. Don, did, did your wife, Carol Lewis, did she, did she directly kill you, or did she hire someone to kill you? I thought I heard a voice right behind me. Female voice, actually. Who was that? Is there someone behind me? When I asked him if his wife directly killed him, or if she hired someone to do it, he said, quote, there's three. Then he says, quote, these are mysteries you tell. Which it is a mystery since this case has been unsolved since he's been missing from 1997. Then I heard a female voice from behind me, and he said, it came from the, quote, manual spa. Which is interesting to me since there is a full bathroom in the other room, and I have heard spirits in the past mention that bathroom, and guests have mentioned seeing orbs when bathing. Makes me wonder if there's a doorway for the spirits in there. Here's a clip from a previous session. You feel to go back to where you came from. Please do not stay here. Okay, Don, is there anything you'd like us to know? Any? Okay, please go ahead. Did you intend for your wife to, for your wife to get all your money, all the millions of dollars? All right. Thank you so much. I'm going to review this session. I want to see just to confirm what you've said to me. Okay, thank you. So perhaps we'll speak again sometime. Yeah. To help you, yes. Okay. Are you in a good place right now? Yeah. Okay, that's good. That's good. Do you have tigers and lions with, with you where you are? Right, that's great. That's that's awesome. That's that's really great. Okay, we will speak again, perhaps another time. Thank you for coming through. I wish you well.